Hey gang, how we doing? L and D here. Um, I'm gonna do a live play for you today, except I'm mixing up things just a little bit, and I'm gonna do a queen charge hybrid. I'm working that back into my attack rotation just so I don't forget how to do it. Um, I can already tell when the, with my first couple attacks, it's been a while. I've gotten really used to my my uh, patented super archer heck of smash, but I gotta keep myself um, polished, I guess, with different attack styles. So. Uh, without further ado, I'll get into it. And as always, you know, I like to start with Bear Trap. Like I've told you before, just psychologically, it helps me because I don't really care about Bear Trap. I do, but I don't care less. You know, so if I pull a single star with Bear Trap, and, and I really don't, um, it bothers me less. I feel like it's, it's like my warm up, warm up attack. All right, so see, I got my. Charge hybrid loaded up. I got, I'm taking four loans. I got two super archers in my mix here just because I really like the super archers, as you can tell if you've watched any of my videos. Um, so I've instead of like a baby dragon or a yeti, I've, I've worked in a couple of super archers and three of those super wall breakers because man, I just I cannot attack anymore. I cannot queen charge without super wall breakers. Like regular wall breakers, they just they, they wreck my attack, not the walls. Put it that way. All right. Uh, and with the queen charge, I do like to go with blimp, yeti blimp, just just to make sure I get that town hall. It's more versatile than the log launcher. Uh, yeah, it's a little more forgiving the log launcher. Whereas it, you know, with the log launcher, if I don't if I don't get the log launcher to the town hall, um, that that can cause me problems, and I usually end up um, using the royal champion to try to save the day, which isn't ideal. All right, let's see. You get Super Arch over there to help fun a little bit. I got two, I got a couple of Expos already locked onto my Queen, so I gotta make sure that three Expos locked onto my Queen. I'll make sure I keep her alive. I'll raise, raise her up. Now, one drawback here is because I only have the two Rages, I've already used one of them. I wanna save the other Rage for the, for the Yeti Blimp. So I'm gonna drop a Freeze on those Expos just to, just to help my queen out a little bit. Because these stupid, sorry, they're not stupid. They're a very positive, valuable troop. These ice golems are really slowing things down. All right, I gotta get, I gotta get this going. I gotta get the hybrid going. So got the king over there to help steer things back to the middle. I think I, my queen is gone. Yep, lost her. I, I, I saw that coming. She just, she was taking a beating over there. All right, heal down. Uh, at least I, gosh, go away, McAfee. Shoot. All right, um, that might have been a mistake. I oh <laughs> yeah, dropped a heal way over there where nothing is. Cool, cool. Thank you, McAfee. All right, I'm, I'm sending the blimp in from the side because I'm afraid I'm not going to get the town hall. I want to make sure I get it down. I, I dropped the skellies on that single target just. Just to make sure that the, the single target didn't interfere with my, my Yeti blimp there. All right, and okay, got the Royal Champion in to help clean up here. Uh, she's working with the King down there. All, everything else is dead, which is phenomenal. All right, so dropping my last Skelly spells just to slow down the scatter shot. This is not even going to be close to a three star. But well, at least it should be a solid two star. Not fantastic. But you know what? You lose your queen early like that. You you're usually not going to get a three star if you lose your queen early in the attack. <clears throat> Which happens to me. <laughs> not always, but it happens often enough that I think I'm doing something. Actually what happens is my queen got boxed in there and she was taking too much abuse. And I don't know, maybe I need to figure out another I, a third rage spell, but I really like the skeleton spells. Skelly spells are great against the single target, so I like bringing two of those. Really help with the world champion on the back end. Uh, didn't work out in this situation. I really could have used another rage spell. So I got a 75%. Good for 24. That's great. All right. But like I said, with Bear Trap, I don't care as much. If I, if I don't three star, I, I can survive. Even if I get a one star, that does happen. So. Yeah, I think I was doing okay today offensively. Look at yesterday though. One, two, three, three single stars. I mean, what the heck? All right. 
And yeah, so I've shown you my defensive logs just a little bit. And I have I did load up a new base for today. Yeah. Give it another day to take some attacks, and I'm gonna give you a review. The plan is to do the review tomorrow. Um, so you can see with Snake Eyes, it wasn't so great. Uh, performance was definitely not so great. This looks like a very familiar base, and I have a bit of a strategy. I have a, a very good strategy using my Pekka Smash against this base, and then my hybrid's a bit different but it should still work. All right, and I start this attack from, this, from the corner from six o'clock. Um, I mean, this is, the base is, has been modified a little bit, certainly, but it's, it's a very similar setup. It comes the king. Uh, I didn't want to use the queen's ability just yet, but it is what it is, I guess. Now, normally I use two rages for the queen right here in the six o'clock compartment. Let's make sure she's getting all the way around there. Um, I don't have that rage to spare with this attack, so this might be a little iffy. And where am I gonna do the hybrid from? Uh, I feel like, I, yeah, she's going slow. I gotta, I gotta get the hybrid going. So let's drop the hybrid in. All right, miners down, hogs down, warden. Queen is not doing great. Yeah, this attack's not going very well for me. This is where I, you know I've I've really gotten used to the the um my Pekka Smash, and I'm, I therefore am struggling with with the um ugh, struggling with the hybrid. Not happy about this. All right. I don't, I don't even I didn't even use the poison on the on the CC troops, which is cool. <laughs> it's not cool. Not cool at all. I'm just I'm dropping spells just wherever I feel like it. Uh this is not a good example of the genre of attack. Alright, let me get the skeleton spells in there just to slow stuff down. Royal Champ is still working. I do have a, a freeze that I'm gonna have to end up using pretty quick. Alright. Champion shield. Champion's gonna die right in this compartment right here. Not much I can do about that. And we're looking at 73. Can I get to 75? This was not a good attack. I told you I'm I am rusty with a hybrid. And not that I was playing great. I, I you know I had gotten to the point with a hybrid where I I felt confident that I could three star with it. That clearly was not a three star. That was a pretty chucky attack, honestly. All right, third time's a charm, maybe, maybe. I, I, I have actually, Warlord is actually having a good day. Uh, well, pretty good day. Plus 198 with two attacks left and three triples in a row. That's a turkey, which means I'm probably gonna, probably gonna muff this one up, but that, that middle one, that BB-78, that was a hybrid three-star. So, still good. I can do this. I can, I can get this done. All right. Uh, I'd like to keep the blimp ready, just in case. Um, with the hybrid, I, I tend to go with the blimp. It's, it seems to work out better that way. All right. I'm going to start at 12 o'clock here. Look healers up. And... Oh, so I need to bust that wall. I think Otherwise, my queen's going to go all the way around. She's going to end up drawing those healers right into the air defense. Okay. Oh, my Yak actually punched a hole through there. That's good on you. All right. And yep, that skill target is locked on my queen here. So, oh, really? Black Mine got, my, got one of my healers. Figures. And of course, single target just right back on my queen. This is again not going particularly well. I get the queen to like go in and like do some damage on those expos. That would be cool. All right, I'm doing the hybrid, but I, I didn't cut much of a wedge. So the hybrid's really gonna just, they're gonna spawn in the center there. I'm gonna go all over the place. It's not, not great. 
Oh, good. Super minions. I love the super. Everybody loves the super minion, right? All right. Blimp, I'm going from the backside on the blimp. Kind of a long travel, but everything should be cleared out in there. I just lost my queen. Okay. I, I do have this one air sweeper that I think I just got my Yetis in there on the town hall. Yep. Did. Okay. Ah, oh, God. I don't even know what to say about this. All right. Champion. Let's throw some wizards down there just because I, I saw the heroes. Go ahead and drop the Skelly spell. This is. Again, just a horrible attack. But it all starts with the queen just taking a walk there. Right? 12 o'clock, I wanted to go in, get that single target, get the eagle, cut a wedge so that the hybrid knew where to go. Instead, everything is just still there in the center, so the hybrid is scattered all over the place. Uh, the hybrid really needs it. They need a path, right? They follow like a path down like three to six works, or if you go nine to six, something like that. Um, but when the but to do that, you have to cut the wedge through the middle, which I did not get. I mean, I saved the two star, but not a good attack. Boom. Well, see, I'm just proving that I have bad days too. I, think I prove that a lot. I think you know I have bad days. All right, gang. I'm L and D, and like I said, I got a base I'm loading up for you. So I'm going to review on that tomorrow. Uh, you can see for Warlord actually had a good day defensively, it's 176. So be sure to check back tomorrow for for that base review. And until next time, I'm LD and take care.